home of WDIV and click on Detroit. Local 4 News at 6 starts now. The community rallies around a firefighter badly burned at the scene of an arson. And tonight, investigators say a senior citizen is responsible. Outnumbered by a group of armed carjackers, two people can only hand over their belongings and watch their ride roll away. All happened very quickly. A gang of three sneaking up on a pair of unsuspecting victims. It happened at a gas station at Plymouth and Schaefer on the city's west side. And this new video shows the thieves weren't just after this black Nissan. Priya Mann is live with a closer look at the video released just this afternoon. Priya. Yeah, this happened at a Valero gas station a few Saturdays ago around 3 in the morning. The victims are parked right here. The carjackers parked right next to them. Security cameras caught the whole thing, and these guys did not leave empty handed. Three men in the silver Ford Taurus are waiting for the victims to leave the gas station. As soon as the man appears, the driver gets out of the car and points a gun at him. It scares me to death. You know, come up in to the store, I mean the gas station, and then you can't leave. It's a lot of chaos. The victim puts his hands up, and that's when two other men get out of the silver Taurus. At gunpoint, one thief starts searching the victim's pockets and pulls out the keys to the black Nissan. The other victim immediately put her hands up. The third thief heads straight for the woman. He doesn't search her jacket pockets, but takes food she had just bought right from her hands. I heard seeing somebody steal stuff out the store, but not just out of their hand. It's crazy. After both victims are robbed, the driver keeps waving the gun around while one of his partners gets in their silver Taurus and the other gets in the Nissan. The male victim then walks back into the gas station with her arms still raised. The female victim slowly backs away. The trio then take off, stealing the 2018 black Nissan. Everybody needs to just be aware of their surroundings and just get in, get out and be gone. It really is scary. It could happen to me. Yeah, this really could happen to anyone. Here's another look at who police are looking for. The gunman is a heavy set man, about 6'3", 280 pounds. The other two are about average height, one wearing a hooded sweater and blue jeans, the other wearing a hooded windbreaker and light blue jeans. Anyone with information asked to call the commercial auto theft unit or Crime Stoppers. Reporting live, I'm Priya Mann.